Now you can do abdominals on the floor. They work very effectively, but we're gonna do them on the ball today. Go ahead and walk out. We're gonna talk about position, which is crucial for an effective abdominal curl. Hands are gonna be out on the thighs just for stability. Rounded shoulders just slightly off the ball. Abdominals nice and tight. Go ahead and start crunching for me, Brad. Nice job. You wanna close the intercostals as much as you can. Keep the pelvic area up to keep the hip flexors flat. You don't wanna drop the glutes. You wanna keep those abdominals engaged. Now if you wanna work them harder, you can come back on the ball a little bit more. If you want to protect the back, you would drop your hips a little bit lower. Go ahead and keep squeezing. Excellent. Let's add a little more resistance. Notice he added an arm on the chest. This is going to change the resistance. Go ahead and add two. I guarantee this will fatigue those muscles. We want to do at least 15 repetitions or until fatigue. Once you hit fatigue, I'm going to ask you to do an isometric hold. Watch this. Hold. Contract those abdominals. Squeeze it as hard as you can. Does that hurt? Yeah, it does. Oh my goodness. I think he's hurting through the abs. Take a deep breath in and you are finished. Come on up. Woo!